Breaking. Chimaroke Namani of the APC was chased out of Kokam Enugu with stones and sachet water. <laughs> <laughs> Things are not just the same again. The electorate this time around don't open eye, like he said in local palace, that we are not going to accept anything below performance anymore. Hello everyone, welcome to Newsport TV. It was quite shocking and embarrassing that His Excellency Chimaroke Namani was chased out of the cold calm Enugu with stones and sachet water, while the security shot sporadically in the air to allow exit. They were chanting Onyori, meaning thief. Indeed, people are not happy. Hmm. It's an understatement when you say Nigerians are happy. In fact, this is the worst, worst that has ever happened in the history of Nigeria when people cannot even access money, where people are buying money to get their own money in Nigeria with our own currency. So let's just quickly dive into the comments. Somebody said, this looks like a 1973 documentary. We are really still far from development and civilization. Another said, 2023 is a critical election. Anyone seen to be supporting the old order will be given a red card. Mama Papa Pekin. Another person said, Yes, I love you. I love you, my Enugu. Wow, I love that. No be now again. We are wiser now. Another said, This is how we do it. We don't support or encourage evil men to run for government just because they are our tribe. Another said, He was busy sharing 20 leaves. For what exactly? A book of 20 naira when he is stealing billions. Another said, I witnessed this. I witnessed this. Even that Elok's windscreen was broken. The securities then add to fire bullets in the air to scare the angry masses. Another said, Look at the state of a nation. Another said, That's why I love Igbo, my tribe. Yoruba people still look to Nobu that delete people at Lagos to gates. If na Igbo land, that thing happened. He go they run for his head, not for president to be. Because if they get him with our army or any security, he will pay for the demise of those that died at Lekki Gate. It can't happen for Igbo land. Quote me anywhere. Igbo people no get king, king go. If you enter there, respect yourself. Make you no collect. Interesting. Another person said, Namani Oyori. Another said, this should be the revolutionary way of addressing all the looters. Another said, he's a big thief now. Another said, we must vote them out. 
Another said, God, help us. Another said, this is very, very good. Another said, the side look the same from 19 whatever. No improvement at all in this particular place. Another said, Nigerians don't de vex, so... Another said, oh my God, they are calling him thief. Another said, this is the way to treat all these people. As they bring them come, they collect. Okay, so those are a few of the comments that trailed the highly embarrassing situation that Chimaroke Namani found himself at the coal city in Nugu. And um, just the way Adam Soshioma left his zone some days ago when he went to the market and took the vehicles, branded vehicles of APC and himself and Ashura Jubala met Sinumbu. And immediately people trooped out and started shouting, OB, 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 OB. He was so embarrassed that he just had to enter his vehicle and drive off peacefully from that place. He also experienced another one when he was addressing a group of people. And he said he was bringing a message from Ashiwa Jibala Met in Umbu. And people started booing him to say, no, we don't want to listen. We don't want to listen. He had to just resort to his personal self. You know, you might take people for a ride for a very long time. You might succeed and everything, but the moment you push them to the wall, you know, they'll be like, what are you guys, have, what have you guys been doing at the top? What have you been implementing? You just keep following each other up and down. We see you only during political periods. And we are not even, when you're, when you're ruling, we don't even see what you're doing. It's not interpreting to our everyday lives. It's, it's, it's just so appalling. And I think... It's a good scorecard for our politica politicians to know themselves now. Know how the people are, are rating you. Know how disrespected you are already. And that, you know what, all the money in the world cannot buy you a good name. I think that's where they lose the plot. They think, you know, once you're being a governor, you're now a senator, you're still at the top, you're still, you know, chopping and cleaning mouth. You know, the level of disrespect, how popular are you with your people? Honestly, politicians are sweating on their noses right now, saying that this group of electorate, because hunger, mm, pain, and suffer, suffer, don't hammer people. Now their mouths are open. Now they are bold to tell their representatives that you've not been doing well. Imagine calling a senator, an ex governor, Unyori, meaning a thief, to his face. Hmm. My people. This is the time that um, everybody needs to adjust himself or herself accordingly. It's quite sad, but it is what it is. And in the next few days, many more of this are still going to happen because people are really, really upset with the cash crunch, especially unavailability of the newly designed Nera notes and also the fuel crisis, toxic environment for businesses, and just an economy that has stopped working. What's your comment on this? Please drop your comments in the comment section below. May God bless Nigeria. Bye for now.